Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to connect Figma to Jira in 2024. So today, we're exploring how to streamline your workflow by connecting Figma to your go-to design tool with Jira, which is a powerful projects management platform. So stick around as I guide you through the steps to integrate Figma with Jira in 2024. And let's enhance collaboration and productivity across your design and development. So let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch us from now till the end so you have full experience. First, you'll have to go and install and configure the Figma for Jira plugin. To do so, you'll have to go and open whatever browser you're going to use to follow this tutorial steps with. Here in my case, I'm actually going to use the this Brave browser, and of course in your case, it could be any other browser that you could possibly have. And as you said, the first step is to install the Figma for Jira plugin from Atlassian Marketplace. So you can open your Jira instance and navigate to Atlassian Marketplace. So go to the URL section, just type Jira, make sure to have or to click on the first link, log in into your account if you have one, if you don't click on get this for free to create a new account for your own. And we'll just go here, as you can see, you can log in with Google, Microsoft, Apple, and Slack if you don't want it to get through all the boring steps of logging into your account and for creating even your account, it will be the same. So for me here, I'm just going to click on login to log into my account, click on continue. And yeah, so we'll be our uh, logged in into our account. As you said, we'll have now to go into the Atlassian marketplace and search for the Figma for Jira plugin. First of all, this is like bright for me. Let me just go and choose the dark theme. Okay, this is better. And of course, if you don't want to like navigate into this, you can simply just go and open a new tab and type Atlassian Marketplace. Marketplace is example, hit the enter button, go to this first link. Of course, if they ask you to log in, just log in again. But let's just check here for on Figma. Hit the enter button. And as you can see, yeah, we have this Figma for Jira, and this is what we want to install. As you can see, and it's a free app, so don't worry about paying anything. So make sure to log in into your account. As you can see, because I'm logged into the other tab, they log me right into my account. Now you will have to go and click, of course. First, you can even see the overview of this app as an example, the reviews of other people, the privacy security supports, versions, installation. And then click on get it now if you want to. And as you can see, you'll need Jira Cloud subscription in order to use this app. So for you, you will have to click on get started with Jira Cloud, as you can see. And to do so, you will be able to get a plan if you want to, or even you can get with the free one. As an example, you'll have to type your site, go to Jira, why not? And just wait, finish. I don't want, okay, I'll have to answer. So for software plans, sprints, and build in Agile, I'll just choose this, projects management, finish. And once well, your site is starting up, so I'll have to wait until this finish. This should not take a lot of time, maybe 10 seconds to 20 seconds. Just wait a bit until this finished. And once it's finished, of course, you will be able to go and download the app without any problems. Of course, after that, you'll have to connect simply your Figma account to Jira and add your Figma designs to Jira issues, collaborate and gather feedbacks, track design progress in Jira, update designs from within Jira, and yeah, you'll be able to do every step that you want to. Of course, once it's finished, you'll find something like this, and here you'll have to name it. I'll just name it Sys, whatever, click on Create Projects. And yeah, we'll be good to go. So yeah, we are here. Now we'll have to go again to the marketplace. So Atlassian marketplace. Yeah, click on here. We're logged into account. Look for Figma again. Click on this. Click on get it now. And as you can see, they will take me to my accounts in Jira software with this, as you can see. So Figma will perform the following action. Delete data from the host application write data to the host application and read data from uh, the host application so click on get it now if you agree to it and as you can see the app is installing now it's free so you don't have to worry about anything once it's installed as you can see you can click on configure and let's just wait for this until it's appear so 
there's nothing i'll just go ahead and click on apps manage your apps uh, this is the figma that's what we want and yeah this is what we want so we'll have to click on configure of course to log it into your account, our accounts uh, i don't know why it show nothing in here let's go click on again on it again and let's see maybe if there's just a problem we'll have to check now of course we can see the screenshots maybe if they're saying something other than that you just log in into your account after we click on configure which they should take us to a page or to pop out to log in into our account because i've already done this and it's made this way maybe there is a problem at the moment but of course for you you'll find the pop out to log in into your figma account and once you do so with the figma plugin connected you can easily add figma designs to your jira issues of course you can go as an example on figma and all the designs that you have here on figma as you can see you'll be able to transfer those designs yeah as you can see now it shows yeah maybe they have just a problem so here i'll just click on continue and as you can see i'll have to allow access i don't have to log into my account again why because i'm logged in here for you if you're not logged in just go and log in into your account then click on allow access it will do all of this if you agree to it just log in into your account and you will be logged in into your account as you can see so entire figma team as an example design updates from this team will be available to all projects in this so sorry just enter the figma url as an example and click on connect and you will be good to go for me of course i don't have a figma team url but i can just like go and get yeah this team url as an example just go and click on here copy link the team i'm the only one who's in this team but that's why not click in here and click on connect how to find of course the url if you want to they will show you how i show you already just go and click on your team in here and click on here and you'll find you'll be able to copy the link of this url without any problems okay so i click on connect without entering the url first of all that's why it will keep spinning in there but after that of course like yeah just connect your team click on connect and everything will be connected and you will be good to go so as you can see they tell you that you'll have or you'll need a paid figma plan to add teams to jira so no need to add teams we can simply just upload or uh, import our designs from figma and we'll be good to go so there you have it you successfully learned how to connect figma to jira in 2024 streamlining of course your design and projects management uh, workflows with this integration you can enhance collaboration track design progress and ensure align uh, alignments across your teams so if you have any question or there is a specific topic that you would like me to cover in the next tutorial just drop it down below in the comment section i'll try to do it as soon as possible thank you for watching and goodbye